Hello everyone, it's Fauzi Anaja, CEO of Playmix. Today I am very proud to be here at Pinifara HQ. First of all, I would like to share my favorite sentence at Playmix. To change nothing, we have to change everything. Because you know, a green car is not a question about powertrain or a, a green engine. It's more than that. We need to have a complete green ecosystem. And in, at Playmix, we have our HUV model hydrogen utility vehicle, the premium hydrogen car, plus our hydrogen capsule. Together, we can provide easier and faster hydrogen to consumer. We can do it. One year ago, we took a great and secret decision. Now in the HUV, we will put a HICE technology, what is HICE, or Hydrogen Internal Combustion Engine. We took the decision for many reasons, but I will explain only three of them. First point, for environment. You know, we don't need battery or cobalt, cantor, lithium for this technology. It's only aluminium, so it's a very better solution to have a green car. Second point, in Europe, you have more than a century of engineering development on turbine engine, and we can increase it thanks to hydrogen. Last but not least, we can preserve patience for automotive driving. We have a wheel style, motion and acceleration. And now, thanks to this V8 engine, we can do it. My work as co-founder and head of design of Nemix is to transform Nemix Vision into real products to create a full and consistent line. This line goes from the HUV exterior and interior to the refueling system, which consists of the hydrogen capsule and the Capix store. The idea is to revolutionize clean mobility by designing the best customer experience. For the HUV, I chose two sources of inspiration, science fiction and American muscle cars from the 60s. Science fiction because with the Capix system, we provide a breakthrough innovation and American muscle cars because we want to bring emotion back into driving. To get the best design proportion, we collaborated with Pininfarina, the most famous automotive design studio, to finalize this futuristic SUV. The key elements of the HUV design are the use of the X, the body lines intersect to form an X on the side of the car, which creates beautiful reflections. The X is also used as a lighting signature in the front of the car, making the car logo visible in the night from a long distance. The challenge of designing an SUV coupé is to avoid a heavy look. And the use of black rocker panels, different from the color of the cars, refined the line. And last but not least is the Capix charging system. My major challenge was to implement the six hydrogen capsules in the rear of the HUV. We came up with this idea to create a hatch under the trunk and to motorize the capsule swap. Once the entire system design, I collaborated with engineers to patent this technology. For the interior, we collaborated with Moroccan designers to add fresh ideas. The key elements of this interior are the concept of space, the use of the X going from the dashboard to the rear seats, and the flying dashboard. We call it flying dashboard as it rises towards the side pillar and the result is a really premium interior which expresses serenity. The choice of the ICE engine means an evolution of the design. So we redesigned the rear of the car, adding new exhauster, which we call EXO. We changed the body color and improved the rear bumper aerodynamic. The completion of the interior and exterior design is an important milestone in Nemix development. We love working with startup companies, especially ambitious ones like Namex. Pinifarina helps in this in this moment of co-creation. We work on the identity, and we also help in the process of refining the design. Here at the moment, we are working on all aspects of the aerodynamics, even on color and material, to bring this exciting product to market. So aerodynamics, of course, is one of the things that Pinifarina is very good at, and Pinifarina design and aerodynamics are a deep link. And here, in particular, we've been refining the aerodynamics, especially towards the rear end of the car, also due to this exciting change in powertrain. An important part of 
the modernity of an object is of course color and material design. Here we wanted to really underline the powertrain concept of this car. We have a color that we call dry ice to really reference hydrogen and also that new exciting technology to really link it to the element of water and to give it this very ambiguous hue between the greens and the blues. We have other elements, of course, that contrast that, and I think that together creates a wonderful balance between, you know, bright and reflective parts and matte and very saturated parts in the, in the definition. Let me quickly talk about aerodynamics. Aerodynamics is something that is deeply ingrained in Pininfarina's culture. We have a wind tunnel, of course, that helps us in the definition of uh, our shapes, of our efficiency uh, when we create bodies. And here, we have continued to refine the uh, aerodynamic efficiency. So aerodynamics is an important part of Pininfarina's heritage, and we try to apply it as much as possible to our formal research. Here, in this co-creation, we had the opportunity to further improve the aerodynamics, particularly on the rear end and the cart, as the powertrain has uh, changed and gave us some more ideas to express as we go forward. We started from a very clear brief provided to us from Namix. We evidently started from the rear of the car because that's where all the main innovation is, as you can see. We have the six interchangeable capsules, the hydrogen capsules. In terms of packaging and architecture, this raised the, the rear height of the vehicle more than what you would on a typical uh, SUV coupe. This also provides the vehicle with a lot of character. You have everything super muscular and having a lot of road presence towards the rear of the vehicle. As we move towards the side, you can see that emphasize in the high fenders and the powerful fenders, you know, so really see it as a, as a muscle car almost. What's special from a styling point of view is that the two front and rear fenders come together to form a very natural cross along the body side. This lets you subconsciously read an X and of course, the X being a very integral part of the brand name, Namix, on the vehicle. All of this is capped off towards the front of the vehicle, which once again has a very imposing and powerful face, underlined by a very clear X DRL light signature. Today's evolution is extremely special because apart from this beautiful dry water color which we're presenting to you, we also have a, a, a special innovation towards the rear on the bumper to be specific. What we have is an exchange port, or what we like to call the EXO, where we get clear water vapor coming out of the rear of the vehicle. EXO is a special name because we're referring to an exchange of hydrogen, we're referring to an exchange of vapor, and a hexagonal shape. So we have everything coming out of this very central and core area of the vehicle that makes it original and unlike any other vehicle you see on the, on the road today. So it doesn't look like your typical exhaust pipe, neither does it look like a typical electric car, which has a very clean bumper with no outlets over there. And we feel this is uh, integral to provide an additional identity and an additional point of reference for the Namix brand.